Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In an era marked by escalating missile use in regions like Ukraine and the Middle East, Lockheed Martin has announced a significant surge in the production of Patriot missile system components. Particularly noteworthy is the amplification in production of the Patriot Advanced Capability 3 Missile Segment Enhancement PAC-3 MSE missiles, with projections set to reach 550 units annually at the Camden, Arkansas site, as revealed by Lockheed Martin on April 9, 2024. This upsurge in production comes as a response to heightened deployments and storage demands in anticipation of potential conflicts, notably concerning territories like Taiwan. Lockheed Martin has taken decisive steps to accelerate its production, expanding the Camden production facility to cater to the increased demand. From manufacturing 350 PAC-3 MSE missiles in 2018, the capacity has now been bolstered to produce 550 missiles annually. The company anticipates further amplification, targeting 650 missiles per year by 2027, facilitated by substantial internal investments despite the absence of additional army funding. A critical aspect of Lockheed's strategy involves fortifying its supply chain through close collaboration with key suppliers such as Aerojet Rocketdyne and Boeing, responsible for providing vital components like the solid rocket motor and missile seeker, respectively. While the U.S. Army is yet to finalize decisions regarding further production increases, the confluence of industrial pressures and geopolitical tensions hints at a sustained demand trajectory. Moreover, Lockheed Martin is not confining its efforts solely to Army requisites but is also advocating adaptations of the PAC-3 MSE for integration into the Navy's Aegis combat system. The Patriot PAC-3 stands as a cornerstone in modern air defense systems, renowned for its long-range, all-weather, all-altitude capabilities. Utilized primarily by the United States and several allied nations including Germany, Israel, Japan, and the United Arab Emirates, this missile system boasts a range of 20 to 35 kilometers, with dimensions of approximately 5.2 meters in length and a launch weight of around 700 kilograms. Distinguishing itself from conventional missiles with explosive warheads, the PAC-3 employs a hit-to-kill interception methodology, obliterating its target through the kinetic energy generated upon direct impact, sans explosion. This feat is facilitated by a solid propellant rocket motor. For precise target navigation and engagement, the PAC-3 is outfitted with an active radar seeker nestled in the missile's nose, enabling autonomous tracking and engagement capabilities. This guidance system receives mid-course updates from ground-based radar and an onboard inertial navigation system, achieving a remarkable top speed of Mach 5, approximately 6,173 km per hour. The integration of the N-MPQ-65 radar enhances detection and tracking capacities, rendering the Patriot PAC-3 an indispensable asset in contemporary missile defense strategies. In Europe, NATO allies such as Germany, Romania, Spain, and the Netherlands have entered contracts to procure 1,000 PAC-2 GEMT missiles, signifying a collaborative approach to bolster air defense capabilities efficiently and economically. This collaborative endeavor incorporates significant local production elements, indicative of a paradigm shift towards more geographically distributed manufacturing in defense procurement. Overall, the escalation in Patriot missile production underscores a strategic response to both present exigencies and anticipated defense requirements worldwide, propelled by mounting geopolitical tensions and the imperative to uphold robust defense postures across multiple theaters. That's all for now, see you later.